friends and family. We gather here today to share in the celebration of Michael and Alicia's wedding. God's blessed them by bringing them together. He's allowed them to fall in love. And after years of friendship and dating today, they'll seal the relationship in marriage by becoming husband and wife. You complete one another. And that's not going to end. That's going to continue. As you're married and, and, and you explore the, the many areas of life, you're going to see how you complete each other in different situations. In marriage, as parents in the future, with the things that you do, you complete one another. And I just want to remind you today, before all of your witnesses, this is God's plan for your life. Amen? That is His plan for your life. That's His design. So guys, in order to keep the power of God and the blessing of God, in your life and on your life together, always make sure that Jesus is at the center of your life and that your friendship is intact. Now, you're already facing each other and now it's time to express your vows of love and devotion to one another. So Michael, you ready for this? Ready. Here we go. With this ring. With this ring. I seal my promise. I seal my promise. To be your faithful and loving husband. To be your faithful and loving husband. As God is my witness. As God is my witness. And Alicia, would you take your ring, place it upon the third finger of Michael's left hand, and repeat after me this promise, saying, with this ring, with this ring, I seal my promise. I seal my promise. To be your faithful and loving wife. To be your faithful and loving wife. As God is my witness. As God is my witness. And so by the power vested in me by the state of California, but more importantly, in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, I pronounce that you are now husband and wife. May God bless you and keep you and give you his peace. Amen. Michael, you may kiss your bride. The best of talking light. It is my great privilege to present for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Matei.